The patella, or kneecap, is a small bone that acts as the body's natural knee shield. Embedded within the quadriceps tendon, it plays a key role in protecting the knee joint and increasing the efficiency of leg movements by functioning like a pulley. Despite its strength, the patella is vulnerable to injury. It can fracture from a direct impact, such as a fall onto the knee or a car accident. It may also break if the quadriceps muscle contracts forcefully while the knee is bent, as happens during jumping or landing abruptly. Patellar fractures are generally categorized into two types. Simple and wedge fractures. Complex fractures. To treat patellar fractures, Oxen offers a specialized anterior patella plate designed for both precision and comfort. Its anatomically contoured, low-profile structure ensures a close fit to the patella, reducing soft tissue irritation. The design includes multiple locking screw options to provide stable fixation, even in complex fracture patterns. The plate is available in two versions. Small, 13 to 19 holes. Standard, 19 to 25 holes. Gaps between the holes helps in faster healing and blood supply to the fracture bone. Crafted from biocompatible materials like titanium, the plate combines strength with excellent corrosion resistance, ensuring long-term reliability. Position the patient supine, with the knee in slight flexion supported by a roll placed under the knee. Begin by reducing the fracture fragments using 1.6 mm K wires. Once aligned, secure the reduction with a pointed reduction forceps. After selecting the appropriate oxygen anterior patella plate, Contour it to match the patient's patellar anatomy using a bending forceps. Using the 2.0 mm variable angle guide and a 2.0 mm drill bit, drill through a distal hole directed proximally. Screw length can be determined either from the measurement markings on the drill bit and guide or by using a depth gauge. Assemble the screwdriver system. Handle, 0.8 nm torque limiting attachment, star screwdriver shaft T8, and screw holding sleeve. Insert a 2.7 mm AV wise lock screw through the distal hole to secure the reduced fragments. Repeat the same procedure for the remaining distal holes. Once this initial fixation is done, proceed with screw placement on the anterior aspect of the plate. Continue drilling using the 2.0 mm variable angle guide and drill bit to create additional holes in the patella. A 2.0 mm threaded drill guide may also be used as an alternative. Measure screw length using either the guide scale or a depth gauge. For variable angle placement, Use the opposite end of the variable angle guide and adjust the trajectory according to the fracture pattern. Insert additional 2.7 mm AV wise lock screws into the pre-drilled holes to stabilize all fracture fragments. Once all screws are placed, verify reduction and fixation stability under fluoroscopy. After the surgery is complete, remove the forceps and K wires.
This concludes the fixation using the Oxen anterior patella plate. Postoperative care includes wearing a knee brace and avoiding weight bearing for 6 to 8 weeks. Begin gentle movements and physiotherapy only when advised by the surgeon. Keep the wound clean and dry, and watch for signs of infection. Avoid high-impact activities like squatting or running for 3 to 6 months.